What's going on, everybody? Mums Chris, and welcome back to some more Undertale. Oh, it's adorable. Oh, wait, we already did this last time. I'm just gonna start the episode here. Oh, it's a giant armor doggy dog. It's the greater dog. This music is amazing. There's Beckham over. You call the greater dog. It bounced toward you. Fucking slobber into your face. Bark, bark. Bark, bark. Bark, bark. Greater dog is seeking affection. Let's pet him. Okay, we already read all this. He's excited and waking up and going back to sleep. He's so adorable with his giant armor. Look, his spear has a face. It's wonderful. It's play. Alright, I think after this one is where I died. Ah, dang it! Here, dog, want some TLC. What does that mean? Uh, let's pet him again? As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight into you. Oh god, that sounds horrible. You, you're moving slow. What? You still haven't pet enough! Oh wow, I... Okay, is my movement slow? Seems okay to me, I think. Pet capacity at is 40%. You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its legs hanging in the air. Bark, bark! Bark, bark! It does not look like a dog down there. <laughs> Your dog isn't contented. You won, you earned your XP and 40 gold. Wow, these guys give me so much gold. Oh, he's so cute. Aww. And now he's just a butt face. <laughs> oh, I love it so much. Woof. It must be bigger on the inside. Do we never went south? Let's see what's down here. Huh. Oh, that's not spoopy at all. Ha! Ah, scare me. A spoop. Oh god! Griff Trot confronts you. The hell's this thing? Check. Uh, some team's directly has a prank. Oh, I see. Leave me alone. Why? You're very scary, but I'll still love you. Just trust your youthful demeanor. No, let's, let's undecorate him. Can we have. You removed the barbed wire made of pipe cleaners. That's horrible. That's a little better. Oh, shh, Nikes. Damn it. I tried to, to stop moving. Griff, uh, Griff Rod is slightly less irritated. Undecorate. You remove a stocking filled with chicken nuggets. What? <laughs> That's a little better. No, oh, no. Is he going to use the same attack? No, he's not. Oh, no. I'm very scared. I'm very scared for my life. Oh, that was about to hit me. Slightly less irritated. Undecorate. You remove the striped cane that says, I use this tiny cane to walk on it. <laughs> a weight has been lifted. Driftroot's problems have been taken away. Taken away. He went, oh god, look at that terrifying face. And 20, I mean, lovely face. He is very lovely. Okay, I, I, mean, I don't know which way is the correct way. I don't want to go the correct way. I don't want to hit a s spot of no return, you know. It's okay, let's go this way. I mean, but that dog's probably guarding like an entrance, right? Surely, he must be. Right, let's go this way. If we see a village, I'll know I'm probably going the right way, which is what I don't want to do. Oh god! Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge! Behold! The gauntlet of deadly terror! Ha! <laughs> when I say the word, it will fully activate! Cannons will fire! Spikes will swing! Blades will slice! Each part will swing violently up and down. The only entire chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it! How's a puppy up there? I see the puppy. Hello? What's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm, I'm about to activate it now! He's not gonna do it. That uh, doesn't look very activated. <laughs> well. This challenge, it seems, maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we gotta use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. The puzzles are very fair. <coughs> Sorry, his voice really hurts my throat. My traps are ex expertly cooked. <coughs> but this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. Phew! What are you looking at? This is another decisive victory for Papyrus. Nah. Huh. Huh. Okay, bye. What do you have to say for yourself, smiley skeleton dude? I don't know what my brother's gonna do now. How are you? I'll make sure I understand blue attacks. 
He's gonna fight me, I know. Okay, let's go see what's the other way then. Is there some very shiny looking things that way, right? What was that? Things keep appearing and it's very spoopy. Something's what is it a goat mom? I was actually looking down when that that thing went back down. Doo -doo. That's not explained, that's gonna be totally something I look at. What is where are your eyeballs? Why are you eyeballs? Why? Every time I walk past that one spot. Oh no. Ooh, I should definitely have healed between battles here. Let me decorate them. That's a little better. Oh no, 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 no. Slightly less irritated. We can do this, you guys. We can do this. Undecorate. That's a little better. Shh. <laughs> Woo! Undecorate. Oh, wait. Has been lifted. Yay, we did it. Oh, that was a terrifying face. Right, let's go up here. Let's see what's in here. Hopefully, it's not a point of no return. What is this? <laughs> See, it's a door. What was that? Oh, okay. Heard a ding. I thought maybe it meant I got a cold right or something. Hmm. So maybe I'm gonna end up over here. I know the code? I didn't see any indication of what the code could be. So I'm just gonna assume I'm gonna end up back here anyways, right? Also, I should really freaking eat. Faded ribbon, okay. Can we call Toriel? Nobody picked up. Oh, I miss her though. I miss Toriel. Alright. Call back some of the HPs. H penises. <laughs> those are some spoopy eyeballs, you guys. They move in unison too, so it makes me think that all four of those eyeballs belong to one creature. Or maybe all the eyeballs in all those caves belong to one creature. That's even more spoopy. Cross over here. These are some cool backgrounds too. We're fighting on the bridge. An ice cap appears. Jerry came too. What? Ah, uh, Jerry. Stitch. You and the other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks away. Your head looks so naked. Oh crap. The other monsters celebrate Jerry's disappearance. There's only other one monster. Silly. Let's ignore. You have to tear your eyes away from the ice cap's hat. It looks annoyed. What? What are you doing? Yeah, this attack definitely seems easier to avoid going up and down. It was secretly, yeah, yeah, checking, make sure we're not checking them out. Ignore. So, who doesn't know? Okay, well, I'll ignore you two. Hey, Jerry's here. <laughs> Freaking Jerry. Go away, ass butt. Turn up, Jerry. Let's, uh, spare. Huh? Did they ditch me? Some friends. Return of Jerry. Stitch him! The other monsters ditch Jerry when it looks away. You won! 13 gold. 13 of all the gold this is. <gasps> Welcome to Snowden! It's a flower! Welcome to Snowden. This music kind of reminds me of Animal Crossing. So does that Welcome to Snowden thing as well. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Heck yeah! I'm waiting to see Goat Mom's gonna be here, right? She's gotta be around here somewhere. Use the box? Eh. Um. Actually, let's. let's we never examined the snow piece. Let's take a look at that. Snowman piece. He was 45 HP. Please take this to the ends of the earth. Uh, okay, so it's kinda. We're gonna take it to the end of the game. Hello, Traveler. How can I help you? <clears throat> let's talk. Care to chat? Say hello. Hiya! Welcome to Snowden. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where do you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? What do you do here? You wanna know what to do here in Snowden? Oh, I thought we were asking what she does, which is pretty obvious, but... Or he. I don't really know. Looks, I mean, it looks like a girl, right? But it looks like she has, like, chest hair or something. <laughs> That's probably just shadow. Grill... Grillby, Grillby's has food and the library has information. If you're too tired, or if you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. <coughs> There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. <laughs> the town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. 
Uh, think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head to the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up camp in Sonin. <coughs> oh, don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The doors have been locked for ages. So unless you're a ghost, or can burrow, burrow under the door, just forget about it. I wonder if that's the ruins where, um... I wonder if these are different runes, or where, uh, Goat Mom is. Your life. Life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic. What? I don't know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? <gasps> as long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. Day after day. That's life, ain't it? Uh, let's exit. Hello, traveler. What could I help you with? Right, let's buy some things. Tough Gloves manly bandana. <laughs> Eat it twice. Hmm. Cinnamon bun, it's my own recipe. Let's definitely get the manly bandana. <clears throat> Thanks for your purchase. We'll also get that as well, I guess. And that'll be good. Yeah. So if anything else, I kinda by now, come again sometime. Like, I wanna keep healing items. Although I guess I could sell sell stuff I don't need. Manly Bandana, let's see what it says. Manly Bandana, Armor Defense 7. Has seen somewhere, it has abs drawn on it. <laughs> that is pretty manly. Use. You cooked with a Manly Bandana. Bandana! Use the box, yes. So let's take these, and I guess we could sell these, actually, right? <clears throat> huh? Sell something? Does this look like a pawn shop? I don't know how it works, where you come from, but... If I started spending money on old branches and use bandages, I'd be out of business in a jiffy. Wow, okay, well, guess I pull all that stuff out for nothing. <clears throat> use the box? Heck yeah, I'll use the box! Alright, the faded ribbon, the toy knife, and the stick. Yeah. Let's visit the inn. Oh, it's a bunny and a little thing as well. Mom says that sleeping can recover your health above your maximum HP. Ooh, what's maximum HP? I don't know. Welcome to Snowden. Sn Snowden's premier hotel. One night is ADG. Sure, why not? Here's your room key. Make sure to bundle up. <laughs> Spoopy monsters, probably. Oh my god. Supposed to be like, okay, I can't do anything during this. Hiya, you look like you had a great sleep, which is incredible because you were only up there for about two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. Did that, oh yeah, I did 30 out of 20 HP. That's pretty cool. Oh, I can't actually go up there if I don't have a key. Cool. I see. Hmm. Nah, let's leave. Well, if you're free to come back anytime. We look at this couch. No, this really torn up couch. This coach. Don't want to walk over. Want, don't want to walk to the other side of town. Try the under snow tunnels. They're efficiently laid out. Oh, that's cool. Holy crap! This place is way bigger than I thought it would be. Yay! So efficient. Now nah, we want to explore all the things. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. This one. She looks very, um, interesting. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable, tee <clears throat> Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its tree like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. Ah, uh, the one we helped. It's a carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to various locals. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. <laughs> Only kids can wear striped shirts. This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics. <laughs> but gillbies. Take a look at the Ooh. <gasps> oh, it's okay, interesting. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help! I want new drinks and <laughs> hot guys! I'm a hot guy, right? Oh god, this guy's terrifying! 
Mm, isn't human food different from monster food? It does... It does things like spoil. When you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. <laughs> the jukebox is broken. Of course it is. The cap is getting pretty crowded, so I heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm. I don't want to see the... The eraser of our local culture. I definitely want to see some city slickers slip onto their butts. <laughs> Girl bees. We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. We love bones. You better watch where you sit down in here, kid. Because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. <gasps> hey, it's. The, oh, these. Yeah, this is the table of all the people we fought in the past. Thinking of getting a spike color to show off my personality. It makes a statement like, Attach a leash to me and you'll take me for a walk, please. <laughs> it just farts. That's weird. I don't know what that is. It's playing poker against itself. <laughs> it appears to be losing. Wow. Put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally going out to make out with the fish. Ah, oh, he is the fish, I see. He is the bird. Those dogs are part of the Royal Guard, the elite military group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. Uh, Grill Grilbs said that he would offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch this stuff. Okay, that's it then. Okay, so it's just a uh, meet everybody here. Hey, there's dog food on there. That's hilarious. Anything else hilarious in here? Not really. I think we've pretty much done all we can here. <clears throat> this guy's freaking creepy, man. He looks very scary. Not a fan at all. All right. I guess in the next episode. Oh god, this this guy right here is pretty scary looking. In the next episode, we'll finish exploring the town and figure out what else is going on. And we'll move on, I guess. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, the best way to support me is by leaving a like and subscribing to my channel if you haven't already. And uh, yeah, if there's any games you want to see me play, check out the link in my description. It'll lead you to a video where you can leave suggestions. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!